the collectors would have to uh, focus on the procurement of land. And uh, we also, uh, I think uh, we've also come up with the demand survey where municipal department, uh, municipal commissioners have been uh, authorized uh, to conduct a demand survey uh, in the ULBs and Nagar Panchayats to do a preliminary study for assessing the demand for MIG plots through ward secretariats. This is one important aspect where collectors would have to take a review with the municipal corporations, with the commissioners there, to assess the demand, then go in for a procurement of land based on the demand. Municipal commissioners are requested to furnish reports daily on demand for MIG plots. We would be developing three kinds of plots there, uh, which will have 150 square yards plots, then MIG2, which will have uh, 200 square yards plots, and MIG3, which will also have 240 square yards plots. So you'll have three sections. One section, MIG1, which will deal with 150 square yards, MIG2, which will deal with uh, 200 square yards, MIG3, which will deal with uh, 240 square yards. So these plots would be available uh, for sale at affordable rates, wherein government will not take any profit in these things, where the property also would be litigant-free property. These are the two things that we are going to emphasize on. E video ganika make natchnat laite like chendi, share chendi. Marini videos kosam ma channel no subscribe chendi.